All right. Well, as, as some of you may know, there was a faith-based adoption provider protection bill. And what this did was protect faith-based organizations from having to adopt children into uh, a same-sex marriage. And uh, that was a big deal. In fact, we support this uh, on the federal level. But here we had an opportunity to actually see this bill get passed in the state of Kansas to protect uh, values voters like us, people who, of faith uh, who want to adopt children or, or, or to help arrange for the adoption of children. Uh, the Human Rights Campaign, they showed up in Kansas with their bucket loads of money and tried to bully the legislatures to go their way. And it was Susan Humphreys and others who stood up to their bullying tactics with their out-of-state money to try and impact the people of Kansas. Also, she worked behind the scenes tirelessly to have to educate other members of the Kansas legislature and to win their support that they need to back this bill. She also was very active in the media, educating, communicating, supporting this bill to all of the people of Kansas in order to garner support. And I am very pleased and proud to announce to you that the faith-based Adoption Provider Protection Bill of Kansas was passed. <laughs> Praise God. And so the one who championed that great victory for our cause is Susan Humphreys from the state of Kansas. Would you please give her a hero's welcome as she comes now to receive her award. Susan Humphreys. <laughs> And now also coming, would you please welcome the President of Family Research Council to present the award. You may be seated. It is a, an honor for me to recognize Susan tonight with, as Gil said, our first award. It is of its nature. It is called the Samuel Adams Award. And to help me present the award tonight is my son, Samuel Adam Perkins. As a former state legislator, I understand the, the influence and the impact that state legislators have in the way our founders created our nation in this federalist system that good ideas percolate up and government is best done when it's near the people. And so I read this citation tonight, Samuel Adam, the Samuel Adams Award is given to a state legislator who exemplifies the courage, character, and service of Samuel Adams. A revolutionary and a statesman, Adams was guided by his deep faith to run for elected office, marshal colonists to oppose tyranny, and help draft the Massachusetts state constitution. One historian notes that Adams was, quote, inspired by his understanding of scripture and his strong faith in God, end quote to seek American independence, protect people's constitutional liberties, and construct an upright society. Samuel Adams served in both the Massachusetts House and Senate before becoming governor. While he is best known for being a signatory of the, the Declaration of Independence and for his involvement in the Boston Tea Party, Adams believed putting God first was the way to ensure the survival of the American Republic. In recognition of your courageous legislative work to protect faith-based adoption and foster care providers from government discrimination against belief in natural marriage, your commitment to children in need of loving families, and your determined, effective advocacy despite strong opposition during the 2018 legislative session. Family Research Council is pleased to present Susan Humphreys with this year's Samuel Adams Award for State Legislator of the Year. Passing the Adoption Protection Act was a joint venture of many people, but only God could orchestrate sovereignly the 63 votes we needed. That's exactly what we got. So thank you to FRC for this amazing honor. Thank you to you um, value voters who are caring about what's going on in your individual states. 
Thank you to so many people that should be standing up here with me from Kansas. And uh, thank you to God for answering our prayers. Thank you.